Hi everyone, it's Juan here from Switchwatch and I'm here with another video today. Slightly different, I'm really excited to do this one because it's a tutorial on how to get a higher score on Thumper. I've had a lot of questions from friends, from family, from people on social media that have said, Juan, I got an S rank at the end of the level but my score is nowhere near good enough. How do I get a higher score? So let's get into the video but before I do, if you like this video, smash that thumbs up button Please subscribe if you like our content. We're releasing it weekly. And please leave a comment down below, guys. I want to be able to respond to you and I want to hear about your opinions, whether it's this game or any other game that's coming out on the Switch or that's already out on the Switch. So let's get right into this. Number one, how do you get a better score on Thumper? What you need to do is you need to perfect those turns. I see a lot of people going into those turns, they're initiating their armor way too early. If you initiate your armor too early, your beetle's just gonna go into the turn normally. You think you've made the turn, you'll get to the end of the checkpoint, you'll get an S rank because you've made the turns, you've thumped every single note, you know, you've hit the blue gems, you've picked up the blue gems or whatever, you get an S rank, but that's not gonna give you a really good score so what you need to do and what I mean by perfecting the turn is you need to leave it as late as possible and then initiate your armor and you'll know when you've done it guys because what will happen is is the game has a certain sound effect that you need to listen out for if you made the perfect turn or not if you haven't made the perfect turn it's not the end of the world you could just restart from the last checkpoint and you'll need to keep doing that section of the game over and over again until you perfect it guys it's the only way practice makes perfect on this one number two learn how to pound if you don't learn how to pound guys you're not going to get the extra blue gems and the blue gems give you a lot of bonus points so when you see the next note on thumper just press up on the directional pad while pressing A at the same time what will happen is is you'll initiate flight mode your beetle will start to fly as you see the next note come along, you need to press down on the directional pad and that will be a pound. And what will happen is you'll see that the game will graphically change. You'll know if you've perfected this or not. And when you do that, you'll get an extra gem that you can then pick up, which will help your bonus. Number three, and this is basic guys, you need to keep that multiplier on times two or times three for as much as the run as possible the only way to do that is by not missing any thumps by picking up all of the blue gems and by pounding as much as you can number four again don't take any damage if you take damage your run is over start again you know uh, start again from the last checkpoint and just restart the whole section because you're not going to get the best score possible all right and number five and probably the most important is you need to put all of these skills together in the section to get the perfect rank and increase that score if you don't do all of these parts together if you miss any little bit if you don't get perfect turn if you don't um pound when you can if you don't get the multipliers for example you're not going to get the perfect score. You're not going to get a high score on the leaderboard. And those people that are in the top 10, the top 20, you're never going to get there, guys. And if that's your aim, you need to practice all of these bits. Now, the great thing about the game is that it breaks up into loads of different checkpoints so that you can restart from a checkpoint if you mess it up. However, if you want to go two or three checkpoints backwards, you can't. So if you mess up, rectify it then and there by restarting that checkpoint that's my only bit of advice that i can give you guys really enjoyed doing this small tutorial for you guys we've got a lot coming up this weekend we've got street fighter 2 review um, coming out on the switch we've got this 5 complete another review that james will be doing uh, part one of that which will be out hopefully this weekend as well and I'll say it again, guys, we really appreciate all of your time. Thank you for viewing our videos. If you like what we do, 
smash that thumbs up button. We love it when you do that. We love it when you leave a comment. And we especially love it when you subscribe. Thank you guys. I'll see you on the next one.